Almost midnight. Yeah, pretty pretty soon somebody might turn into a pumpkin, I guess. Uh, hey, first of all, just, you know, on a Thursday night, late kickoff, 8 p.m., and just for our student section to show out like that and Pirate Nation to show out like that on an ESPN national TV game, that was freaking awesome. And our kids fed off of that. And, um, you know, they love playing here and they love playing in front of Pirate Nation. So just to see that, that, that was amazing. Um, you know, I was telling somebody we played some several night games, but I'm not sure we've ever showed up to the stadium for a pirate walk, and it's already night. Obviously, uh, most of our night games have been Oct in uh, October before you have the daylight savings time change. So that was pretty cool. And just the whole environment, you know, you, you always worry about a late game. Hey, we're going to get up too early, you know, waste our energy during the day and not get to game time. Uh, but our young men certainly save their energy to game time, and they're in the first quarter and, and uh, got off to a great start, you know, putting points up early. I think we had 418 yards in the first half, most since 2014 at offense. And Kate and those guys are clicking over there right now. And just so dang proud of them. And it's not just Kate, you know, not just this guy or that guy. It's all of them, you know, receivers, running backs, O-line, quarterback, all on the same page, you know, in the same same uh, mindset with the same vision and goal. And then defensively able to get some three and outs there early in the game, get the ball right back to our offense. You know, I looked up there as a defense coach. I looked up there at one time. I think, you know, little time possession for us and a big time possession for them. I was like, oh, man, we got to slow this thing down a little bit. And I told John Davis, hey, keep scoring. Keep going at them. And, uh, you know, the, the finish the half off the way we did, uh, 14 points right there, was huge. There was a fourth down in there I wanted to go for, but we, I think it was 21-7 at the time. I said, well, if we, if we don't get it, you know, it's 21-14. That's not the way you want to go in the half. Uh, so, you know, I ended up punting the football. I told John Davis that we'll get the thing right back to you. We got it back. He scored, got it back again, went and scored again. So that was a huge uh, swing right there, right before half. But just so proud of our young man, proud of our seniors. Uh, you know, our mindset's always been a win that day and win, win the focus of that day. And, and certainly they've done a great job of doing that during the bye week. You know, it was 12 days. They, they certainly could have lost focus and focused on something else. Uh, but they focused on the FAU, going 1-0, and and now certainly be Tulsa and see if we can find one, one more time and get a win and, and get these guys bowl eligible and get these seniors to a bowl.